G'day, I'm Jim Begley, Landscape Restoration Officer for Golden Broken Catchment Management Authority. We have an Australian government funded project in the Dookie Bylinks area in Victoria. Uh, this project uh, works with Indigenous uh, people in, from Yorta Yorta and Bangarang country. Hello, I'm Carl Atkinson, I'm from a land management group called RADCOM. Our job is mainly on land management and more or less beautification of the local area. We work with a person named Jim Begley, he's been in partnership with us uh, for the last three years. And what we've done out here at the uh, at Dookie district is more or less work with local farmers as well as local groups out here on putting native vegetation back into the areas and um, working with the farmers in the area putting plants and native plants back into to the local area. Um, plus we also work with the seed propagation group here in the Dookie area too as well. This is Acacia del Barta silver wattle. Breaking up the seed pod to expel the seed. A shake of tops and tops for the seed, Kim, Kim Cedar, it separates it from the actual uh, the husk of the, um, of the plant. Um, when Maddie's ready you'll sort of see how the process works so it'll it'll show you how it, how it comes out the other end. after it's been put through the King Cedar. We also put up to eight to ten people through our courses on land management as well. Um, we've had a good opportunity with the Catchment Authority as well as the Yorta Yorta Nations to more or less bring this um, uh, project, uh, what we're doing now, um, to some sort of uh, uh, understanding with the local farmers as well as the catchment authority too as well and we're sort of very pleased and lucky that we have the opportunity to do so. Um, we've thoroughly enjoyed our, our work out here and we hopefully uh, at a later date hopefully it to continue for our indigenous group of people as well as um, learning people in land management as well as um, seed propagation um, as well as we do a lot of spraying uh, for weeds and other things that are not native to the area too as well. Uh, two of our Indigenous employees in this project, the Dookie Bylinks project. Fellas, uh, how have you found the program so far? Pretty good. Yeah, yeah good. And what have you learnt, do you think? What skills have you learnt over the last year or so? Oh. I learned how to spray, how to cut trees, eradicate the weeds. Stuff like fencing, revegging. We've been uh, working on working with com community to protect and enhance the remnant vegetation that's left in this country. It's a very productive country in the Dookie area, so a lot of the the work that we're doing is working with farmers to um, connect the last remaining vegetation and also to enhance the biodiversity assets of the area. This is typical box gum grassy woodland country, hilly country. Really we've got two examples here of, um, of pristine condition on one side of the fence and then an olive infestation on the other side. So the crew have been working on removing olives from the, um, the better side of the fence and the landholder's been very good in um, being supportive of the crew working on their property.